just take this away from you. I'll get by. Huh? Okay. I can take you, this one right over here. I'm a, yeah, that's Although fine. You, you can use this you one. You sit on this one because this one only reaches so far. Oh, so switch I will. I will switch. Okay. Woo! Bad maneuvers going on right now. All right. So my main man, my my partner, my best one of my best friends, Pika Pika, aka Neil Freer, aka twin, King of Two V Ones, stepping up on the commentary, stepping up on the booth right now, ready to play a singles match with my man Mask. You just saw him lose doubles. I think he might be a little bit demoralized. Not to mention the fact that Neil is a fair amount better than him at this game. It's looking <laughs> like it's going to be a slaughter right now. I have full faith in my boy. It's Sheik versus Falcon. Sheik definitely wins this matchup. How much depends on how much better the Sheik is than the Falcon. I know and, that doesn't yeah, really and, quite and make too much sense. Time and stuff but like that. as funny. you can see, this match looks really bad when the Sheik is way better than the Falcon. When the Falcon is better than the Sheik, it looks even, but the edge still definitely goes to Sheik in this matchup. Anti-airing him with four tilts. Like I said, that is the that is the mark of a smart player, an old school player. He's gonna do some. He's gonna know his spacings and his moves really quite well. Oh yeah. <sighs> okay, now Falcon trying to put something together. You can see he's just being he's being a little bit reckless, throwing out a lot of moves. He's getting kind of frantic. Nice tech, but gets punished anyway. Neil Fur, Pika Pika knows how to knows how to cover all the options. That's the kind of thing you learn when you've been playing Smash since 2005. You learn how to know what your opponent's gonna do. You know how to cover those options. It, it doesn't look like Street Fighter, but Is that we how definitely I do this? have what do I do? tons hey, of Snowman. options to select in this game. Snowman. So I, I go over there into Instead it. Instead of hitting a bunch of buttons at once. It's supposed to work, right? And getting the when move this? that's gonna be best right, for the situation. Like Smash option op op selects just basically consider oh, covering sweet. your options okay, with we'll one move and putting them in a position where they're gonna be so laggy that they're gonna get hit by a follow-up attack if you hit them with that. All right. And these needles, these needles are looking pretty solid right now. That's a troll. This is this is what we in the business call a troll. Because he definitely could have killed him anytime he wanted to, like he just did. <laughs> Yep, looking, looking pretty much what I expected. He's gonna need to get a couple grabs. Is he gonna, here. is he gonna be able to get this stock off? It looking like he's gonna be able to get yep, this stock off. Yup, there it is. Okay, nice. Catches him with a little bit of dash dance mix-ups. Dash dance needs pretty good. He had no reason to full hop there, so of course Neil's gonna stuff with back air. Catches him with the nair. Oh, Neil, she putting out that nair to stuff the Oop. stuff the grab combo. Oop. Okay, catches him right as he hits the ground. Oh, oh we got helper. combos. Oh, smart oh, move to go it. to the stage. He thought he was going for the ledge, but. You could tell by the very specific spacing he was going for the stage, knowing that Captain Falcon's gonna rush for the ledge. He's gonna be a little patient right now. Oh, nice. Yeah, just throw some, just get some percent on him, throw some needles at him. Oh, barely gets yeah, to the get stage again. Gets the grab. It looks like it, and it almost looked like he had the muscle memory right there to be doing another jump from the ledge to remain invincible, but it wasn't gonna do him any good. And catches him with happens. the reverse knee. All right. Uh -oh. We got dash attack to down smash. We're gonna bait his get up. Whatever option he picks, we have the speed to punish it because we're chic. We're gonna put him off stage, and we're gonna keep putting him off stage. A little bit of a little bit of a technical flub right there. And oh, Ooh, that, that just been really weird. barely di's away from the foyer. That was very good di survival di to uh, get away from that combo. But he is still off stage. Wow, and that's that is the to dumbest happen. thing I've ever seen. <laughs> that was so low. You must not play melee very much, cause there's things way stupider than that in this game. Yeah, well, I mean, if sure. he wanted to, if I was Neil, just to troll, I would hit him with a forward air on shield and then just duck under the shield grab. That's some really stupid stuff. As you oh, can he see, seems to be Neil, spot Neil using well. his patented shield, near out of shield. Oh, oh no! That was cute. That was the best part was that wasn't fast at all. It was just slow and methodical and just, it hurt more because you knew what was going to happen the whole time. <laughs> you know what, 2014 Neil is great because it's, it is 20, 2007 Neil. 2007 Neil and 2014 Neil are exactly the same. <laughs> Yet he still manages to place in the money in every tournament he goes to in this region. Didn't you just lose to that guy? You just lost to that guy. Ooh, nice read. Oh wait, you did beat the okay. You got luck. Wow, that was that was shout outs to Roy. <laughs> Looking like <laughs> Mass is doing well with some Because I saw Roy I on the screen, I just assumed he I was mean, gonna lose. Obviously the grab game is amazing there, but he wasn't getting a whole lot of grabs and he okay. was spot dodging and he wasn't really capitalizing on it. So the fact that the platforms are here means he does net free up airs. The efforts that he could normally get from just a regular old up throw on Sheik, which is kind of necessary for the matchup. It's really, really hard to do. 
but uh, completely necessary, which is why this matchup is so hard, is because Sheik will combo you ridiculously hard, and you have to combo just as hard as she combos you, and she edge guards you for free, and you kind of do too, in a way. That And that's the biggest thing. That's but, the biggest thing that like, this makes is, this a should difference be free, between but he's, a he's caliber of player. I would probably have, I mean, he had to maintain invincibility throughout that whole situation, which was would have totally been fine, it's just he, well, obviously he did, and he got fire. Okay. Neil is missing a lot of his edge guards attempts right Forward now. Forward and that looks like the first stock combos. after a minute and now what, he's gonna keep seconds. it smart. He's gonna keep it smart, he's gonna keep it simple. He's still living. Gonna charge some needles, nice. grab the ledge, he's charged up for the next round. That's that's another distinction. Mm. That's another distinction that I see really often between new players and older players is that new players, they like to be cool, they like to do fun, flashy things, so they're gonna pick an option that may not be as good, especially when edge guarding, when Hitting the ledge, Ooh, nice grabbing the ledge and hitting R will take away stocks 50% of the time, well, sure. at least. It's pretty free, especially if you're Sheik, because you have an invincible backer from the ledge, and Falcon is, you know, is, has the worst recovery of any of the top tiers. Makes him almost not viable, according I would to certain people I would in the world. say it's better than Sheik's. I would say Falcon's recovery is better than Sheik's. I don't think so on that. I think he, uh, it's it's pretty it's kind it's of pretty deba debatable. It's, it's, it's much easier to hit, and in terms of a sheik, all you gotta do is just stick your leg out right now. He, yep. Oh God, Neil, live it. Got it anyway. Oh, he 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 gave y'all something. You thought you thought something was gonna happen. He was like, nah, nah. Keep it keep it real. Down throw anything. Regrab. No. Oh, it does not turn around. I knew I saw what he was going for. It's gonna get that simple tech chase. Second in place is often one of the best things you can do, and also destroys you. I mean, it, it, it like really it just depends. Did. Yeah, it kind of did destroy. You got, I mean, because you, you'll listen free down smashes, up smashes, stuff like that. But it's it's sometimes one of those things where people are like, all right, he's gonna tech left, and then all of a sudden he doesn't move, and you're totally frozen. You can't do anything about it. And like that, grab the ledge, jump from the ledge, grab the ledge again. He didn't have to throw out any attacks. He didn't have to hit a B button or an A button. Oh, nice but he grab. Got the kill. That should be free though. Unfortunately, nice. Grab ledge. See? Oh, now you're dead. Going for technical things. He waited Almost for the roll. Almost got him killed. He had a free grab, but Neil often to go for the soft read, which was ultimately a hard read. <laughs> he just throws simple needles, nice. single needles to just. Ooh! That was that was a very Get nice combo. Done. Very smooth. Oh, that was free. Mm, and does those not are things punish like, the air dash. Those are the things that the longer you play this game, you really start to capitalize on. And it's it's hard. I mean, Neil's been playing this game since, what, 03, 04? Something like that. He was, he was, he was winning GameCubes. He was winning systems in tournaments when he's they a, were back in He's an in old day. human being. He's, he's a very old person. In, in comparison to the most of us around here. Wow. Oh, jab, jab, oh, yeah. oh. I could tell he was wanted to go for the forward air, but Captain Falcon was so heavy, he wasn't going high enough for it. So he was Didn't like, I'll just like keep it. jabbing. I'll just keep jabbing until I figure out something else to do. It's a pretty sweet combo. <laughs> any comments? It's relatively any, any comments for the any comments for the lovely stream monsters? <laughs> He's like, nah, I ain't talking to nobody till I get this money. All right, kid goggles signing off. Gotta jump in to see if I can find around a PM to play. I'm gonna be back. It's very difficult to speak sometimes when he's speaking because he speaks a lot, all the time. I don't know. He's a cool guy. It's just difficult to commentate with him. I'm not just talking to him behind his back or anything, but... Yeah, it's...